ones, day ones, no time for fake ones, got me, I got this is the second date update on the 10 with Ramiro, Pebbles, and Melissa. The Get Up Crew. Hot 96.9. Mark, how can we help you, sir? Hey, so I've been seeing this girl, Dana, for about three, four weeks. Mm-hmm. Um, she's pretty cool, man. We met at a bar, and we, you know, we really hit it off. We went out to dinner last weekend, and I'm looking forward to, you know, what's going to happen next between us. <laughs> what was it that, what when you guys went out last time, what happened? She uh, she just ghosted me, man. Like, we went back to my place right after dinner. Yeah. And we hung out, and the next morning, I had a meeting, and she kind of just left. Hmm. That's never good. Did you leave something out that maybe she found <laughs> that might have scared her off? No, I have nothing like that laying around. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so, it's hidden in the back of the closet. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so she spent the night... You guys had a good night. She stayed until the morning. Right. Then I had my Zoom meeting for work. And yeah. after my meeting, she I came out to look for her. She was gone. I'm sticking with the she found something you just don't know about. Sometimes you have something weird yeah. lying around the house and you might not realize. Listen, we've had people who saved their piss in the fridge. Damn. <laughs> I'm just Thanks saying. for that reminder. <laughs> like, <laughs> there's probably... Right, listen, I do not save my piss in the fridge. Man. <laughs> <laughs> don't do that. I'm not saying it was piss in the fridge, but it was something. Like, maybe she found some dog poop somewhere. Maybe she saw some sh- stain on your underwear. I, I, there's definitely... There's just no way that she's just going to leave without telling you. And hey, man, then... that's free ball. You free... Okay. <laughs> okay, well, in that case, I, I would go through your place again because she robbed you. She either found something she didn't like or she found something she did like, took it, and bounced on you. But other than that, unless you're leaving something out, there's just... I can't think of anything, at least. But anyway, whatever. We'll give her a call for you next. Maybe she'll answer it. Now back to the second date update on the 10. With Ramiro, Pebbles, and Melissa, the Get Up Crew. Hot 96.9. We just spoke to Mark. Sounds like a nice guy. He said that him and da- this girl Dana, they've been hanging out for a couple weeks. And the last time he saw her, mm-hmm. they went out. They had a good date. They went back to his place. She stayed the night. So I'm not even going to ask if the sex was good or whatever. Uh, clearly, you know they had sex. You know it wasn't terrible because she didn't bounce on him in the middle of the night. He said that in the morning he got on a, a Zoom meeting for mm-hmm. his job. And then when it was done, she was just gone. Pebbles asked if he, she possibly found something in his house that sketched her out and made her want to bounce. Mm-hmm. Mark, do you have a room, and I'm only asking this because it's happened before, do you happen to have a room in your house that's dedicated to Adolf Hitler? Ooh. No. <laughs> what? <laughs> no. Oh, yeah, that <laughs> happened once before, that didn't it? it? The guy said, he was, no. the guy said, well, I mean, he's a masterful speaker. Uh, okay, okay, so okay, let, let's try and call this girl Dana right now and see what happens. So stay quiet, Mark. Hello? Hi, is this Dana? Maybe. Who's <laughs> okay, okay, Dana, this is Romero, Pebbles, and Melissa from, from Hot 96.9, the radio station. I can explain to you why we're calling you. We got your number from somebody who likes you. So the, what we're doing is a good call. It's a guy who likes you. You know him. And according to him, he likes you, and he feels like you like him too. So the reason we're calling you is because if you say yes to a date, with this gentleman, we would uh, basically you get to choose the date, and we'll pay for any type of date that you choose, and we'll tell you the guy's name too, so you're not being surprised with anything. All right. That sounds good. So far, so good. Okay, so far, so good. So he is somebody who you went out with and hung out with before, and he's confused because he said, according to him, you kind of just left him, and he hasn't heard from you since. His name is Mark. No. No, no, I'm all good. Thank you. No, no, I'm hold on. Good. Okay, hold on. I'm all set. <laughs> okay, can you, okay, well, can you just say, you don't have to do it. Can you just say what the more, so we can tell him because he, he's very confused. Um, we, we have a suspicion that you found something kind of sketchy in his house that scared you off. No, but like, no. Um, you know, when you, you know, we've been dating for a while, a few weeks, and, you know, you get to know somebody, you know, you talk about, Work comes up a lot because that seems to be all we're doing these days. And, uh, you know, like you said, we had a great time, went back to his place. Um, But, you know, in the morning he wakes up, tells me he's got a meeting, which is cool. Um, He logs on to this 
conference Zoom call. Um, and, you know, there's no video or anything. Um, so I figure, hey, we can maybe have some fun and we can put it on mute and, and see where it goes and try to ease the board in them a little bit of a uh, work call. Well, he didn't mention this. But, <laughs> um, but you know, as we're, we're having a good time and starting to get into it a little bit, the voices start popping up on the uh, Zoom call. And all of a sudden I realize that uh, I recognize one of the voices. And it turns out that my dad <laughs> is his boss. <laughs> Your what father? The f- what the f- What? Hold on, hold on. No way. Data, wait, wait, wait. Here's Data. the thing. Is that Mar- in these three, four weeks, he's been bitching about work and about his <laughs> head of a boss okay, stop. for Data. weeks on end. No. Dana, Mark is on way. the phone. Mark's that Mark my can- dad is his boss. Okay, Mar- uh, Dana, Mark can hear what you're saying. He's on the phone and he heard you say that. Oh, f- Dana. <laughs> Hey, that's your father? That's my that's dad. How can you oh my my dad God. like that? I'm, I'm sorry that you're related to him. <laughs> oh, yeah. that's your cousin. Excuse me. You're the daughter of Steve. He is a and oh you are Oh, my God. What do you, wait, oh, hold you on a second. Go f*** yourself. I'm done. Wait, 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 wait. wait. We didn't even ask. Maybe, Maybe Dana still wants to go out with you again. No, no. All listen, good. listen. If, if she's you. related to the guy who takes three weeks to pay me, so do you don't do you not this want guy, us to ask her out on a date? Another date? I don't want to be related to anybody related to him. Like I don't want to be you know involved with anybody like that. I can't even go through the list because this guy is such a prick, man. <laughs> He's a piece of <laughs> and I want nothing to do with her. If I have to see that guy's face, I, oh my god. <laughs> Listen, at least she was sucking my <laughs> during the Zoom meeting. Oh god. <laughs> well, that was nice of her. Hello? Oh, he hung up. Oh, so Dana, uh, never mind. You know what? Good riddance to him, and I'm going to make sure my dad fires that piece of shit. 